forever. Yeah, pretty it's much. Like, don't don't even pay attention. Make the other person start taking the soap post stocks. You can you can actually do that. That's one of the weaknesses. I would say it's not exactly viable until at least the second to last stock. Yeah. To like just literally let the ice climber live. Yeah. Because they they can have impact. Yeah. Sopo, Sopo's not terrible. Sopo's just, still really strong. I think at high percent he's pretty useless though. Because he just gets everything just knocks him away as the squall hammer takes forever. This will be interesting though. I don't know how this will go. Sun Tzu really good in teams. Yeah, Sun Tzu's really aggressive, really strong. Really good at living. Pressure wise in teams. Yeah. Um I would say the objective for Sun Tzu and Korn is to probably um Get Korn in positions where he can edge guard the fox, and yeah. Sun Tzu sets him up by, you know, kind of ushering him low with the lasers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, kind of batting away the peach. Are you not in the Iron Man? I don't know if you're in the Iron Man. I know I'm in the Iron Man. There's a good amount of people in it, so I don't know. Huh? I mean, can, can, yeah, he, he wants to know if he's in the Iron Man, those two. Uh, Sun. <laughs> It's got brackets right here. Alrighty, so. Horn and Sun 2. No, these are the rules right here. There's no character locking. Though. Yeah, you, you can you can pick. Wait, is there? Oh, you. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. I was about to say because it said no character lock before, and I was like, that's not a good Yo. idea. Yeah, James Iron Man me. I'm not in it though. Long, long Should time. I enter? Long time no see, James. Fuck. Enter me in. I'll give you two bucks. Yeah. Why wouldn't you enter the Iron Man? All right. Enter so we're starting. In. FD. I have money. I think it's at the desk over there, Yeah, right? it's at the front desk. They could probably put you in. I don't think it's started. Wait, you are in the Iron Man. No, oh, him. Man. Oh, okay. Oh. Just, uh... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he could probably there, there, there get there in. Be. Oh, okay, well then whatever. I don't care. We should Iron Man anyway. Commentation. <laughs> yeah. All right, so FD, this is a bad stage for uh, Cheek. Yeah, but I think a strength that it gives her is that there's no, like, uh, platforms that Fox can run around. It's kind of hard to deal with a Fox falling on top of you as Sheik. Yeah. Unless, like, you're really accurate with those F tilts. and. Um, I think the edge guards are super easy, too. Yeah, there's they're no really easy. Here. There's no there's no platform mix-ups. It's yeah. just high to the ledge. It's just going high or to the ledge. That's all That's all there is. Yep. I think Falco does really well in, in doubles on this stage. Yeah, for sure. A lot of the time when Falco gets a follow-up, which in this team, Sheik Peach, they, uh, Sheik Falco, they combo like very, very, um, uh, what's the word? They, vertically? Uh, they, yeah, they mesh really, they mesh really well because they both combo vertically. Yeah. So a lot of the time when Sheik is getting like uh, juggles with, with uh, tilts and stuff or like up airs, they'll land on the platform before Falco can get there. Yeah. But this stage is just like, it's all just air air balls. Like, yeah. Falco can get any pickup that he they wants. They both have good full hops, so they can just follow up off their, their stuff really easily. Like, right there, if Korn was being more aware of the Shine Bear that Sun Tzu could have done, he could have thrown an up air to intercept and kill the Fox. Yeah. Like, that's kind of one of the examples that you could see from the synergy of this team. Yeah, for sure. Right now, Red Team's kind of getting... Yeah, I'm actually kind of surprised. I mean, honestly, I think this matchup for Falco Peach, people usually say that, like, Falco has a tough time versus the chain grabbers on FD. But, like, you can't really chain grab Falco on this stage. And yeah. besides the chain grab, Falco actually probably has more positives on this stage than I think Peach. the lasers are really good yeah, on this stage, especially. Yeah, I think, especially. like, when, when you're playing, like, singles, like Falco versus Peach, the, the chain grab is really polarizing, but if you remove the chain grab, which doubles kind of does... Falco probably just wins straight up He just wins straight up, straight up yeah. because, like, his neutral is just so much better on this stage than Peach. Yeah. Oh, this is... Good save attempt, but it also netted a kill, so it was kind of like a a, a neutral... Wow. Oh, how, was that a ledge dash? Missed yeah, ledge dash? Missed ledge dash. I didn't think he really had the ledge dash because there was Invincible Weedle coming down. Yeah. He could have just... Did and he had a lot of space up. to just get up, yeah. Just sledge hop on. I kind of don't like Corn going in here. I, I want to see the fresh Falco stock, like yeah. kind of kind of get its damage in. They're kind of making it work right now, though. Ooh, 
Uh, up smash conversion. Nice We're not a stock pressure. to play around with. Dead? Yeah, it's not dead, but. Ooh. Okay, this is scary for your son too, right Those here. He's kind of sandwiched. Roll. Yeah, Falco definitely is super susceptible to getting like sandwiched really hard. Yeah. But at the same time, Falco is really good at fighting two characters with with lasers and is really amazing um, down air shine pressure. Yeah. And see, this is what I was saying that Falco should have went in in that earlier interaction because now we have a high percent Falco <gasps> that oh. will die at any moment. Yeah. There's three people who are at basically any hit will kill right now. Corn, he can kind of oh, throw out moves nice. right now. I think. Yeah. I kind of like the way they played it. Corrin really um, did not allow Snacks to give Weedle the support that he need because Falco, um, yeah. Falco, like, attacking a Peach on the ledge is really difficult to, like, surmise, like, try to trick the Falco yeah, into yeah, getting yeah. back on the stage. Exactly. That's one of those interactions that we were talking about where, like, remove the chain grab and what does Peach really have against Falco on FD? You know what I mean? Not much. I guess just a decent combo game, but that, re that requires getting in. And also, I, th I think Peach's combo game is probably better on platforms, to be honest. The tech get, I think platform tech chasing is very good. Yeah, because you get more grabs and, like, more down smash opportunities and, like, uh, Sun Tune and Corn. So, I think with FD, you really only get, like, two or three hits. But, like, on platform stages, you can get, like, four or five pretty easily. Yeah. I think the team combos for uh, Peach... Uh, Fox might be better on platforms too. Yeah, because like Peach has a really tough time like double jumping to areas. But yeah. like with platforms, she can full hop wave lane and then do full hop again. Yeah. And then like Fox can like follow he does up whatever up he air, wants. Yeah, he'll, back he'll, air. You know, it doesn't matter what stage. He's versatile yeah. enough where he can reach, you know, do the utmost on any stage. But uh, let's see where they go. I'd probably take Falco Sheik to Dreamland. Yeah, I think uh, what they Maybe really Yoshi's. what they really need is like I think Yoshi's is a good good choice. Um, yeah. Sheik will die really early to. Falco doesn't have space to you know run around. Yeah. Neutral game. But also at the same time, you have to realize that like if Sheik plays a certain way, like All a right. back a back air oriented game or and a down smash spammy game. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And Falco kind of like abuses like how good F smash spaced on shield is it's kind of like they can cover a lot of space with like spammy a spammy strategy on uh on yoshi's but at the same time i think the down smash like fox up smash strategy on yoshi's is probably like way more way yeah more prevalent so they're gonna go to dreamland i kind of agree with this it really just depends how they plan on playing it i, I think, think they did good on like team combos and kills it was really just like um Weedle was just dying really early, and also that one SD that Snacks had. Yeah. If they're I, comfortable with, like, Falco living a decent amount of time, then this should be a, a fine stage. But, yeah, that's, like, the, the weird thing about it, though, right? Like, Falco will live longer, but a lot of the time, Falco is kind of one of those characters where, like, yeah, I lived the initial kill, but, like, in terms of distance, am I really going to make it back? Like, yeah. Because it makes it such an easy edge guard. For sure. Oh, that's... He's living. Right, we don't Corna. have really high percentage. We're not really low percent. He can just... Oh, nice jab fair. Wow, good double kill. That was yeah. actually the best best thing they could have gotten because yeah. if they killed Peach too early, that would give them... Oh, what? Was that a missed ledge dash, I think? I think that was a missed ledge dash. Again, that was one of those situations where he didn't have to ledge Ooh. dash. I thought, he, I, I thought he lost his jump. If there was no double jump there, that Peach was definitely dead. Yeah, Look at the 30. pressure. This is like what you want to use low percent Falco for. Yeah. Nice. Falco can get, like, someone to 50 easily with one hit, you know. And also, there. like, he can abuse crotch canceling. And, yeah. like, he can easily fight two people. That's why I think, like, throwing in the spacey first is always good. You always yeah. want to get the most value out of those low percent stocks. Because Ooh. here, you don't get any value. Because the 2v1, you're always just going to get hit. It's not like you're going to do any effective damage where you'll do, like, multiple hits on them. Yeah. A problem with this stage, I think, for Peach is uh, the top platform. Sun 2 is just sitting on there. And the Peach I, couldn't do anything I about like it. that fair from Korn, but I feel like they should have just uh, gone two angles. Because uh, if Weedle was the only one that was edge guarding there, he would have to choose to attack one person. Oh, wow. Ooh, that was almost like a crazy... I don't know what they were doing yeah. there. <laughs> I think I think Sun Tzu wanted him to like attack off of the hold, and Korn wanted to throw. Yeah. Um, I think you can kind of see things like that with teams that aren't really that synergized. I, yeah. I believe this is probably like one of their first couple of times teaming. Yeah, maybe even sure. their first. A team with more synergy, like definitely, figures that out faster and gets a kill off of it. 
Not even a kill, just like positional advantage too. Like you don't always have to get a kill off of like the throw yeah. combos. It's really just about Hit putting them away, in it. start comboing the other one. Yeah. Nice. That was Grab really life. good. Um, Sun Tzu was covering the ground grounded option of running towards the center, and Corn uh, covered the the platform option by fairing uh, yeah. the platform. And you notice how the positioning's going. Um, I didn't really like that positioning from Sun Tzu because it was kind of like a. Uh, a 1-2-1-2, one, two, one, two, where he was in the middle of two play, uh, the second team, and his teammate was had to go through someone to save him. Yeah. This is good stage positioning by Blue, because Falco has so much... Ooh. Oh, barely did not make it. Okay, that... Nice slap, but he oh, will die really for nice. that. Yeah. He can probably get this Fox stock if he hunts him down. He's Snacks hunting him. A, Snacks evasion is really good, though, so it's kind of hard. Ooh. Shield poke. Yeah. yeah. Needed the light shield this is, What's important right here is if Sun 2 doesn't get comboed early. You see? Yeah. He's dead, so if he gets team comboed. I feel like he needed to go in a lot more because Korn was in a position where he could not defend himself, so he needed. Sun 2 needed to make himself a threat rather yeah. than just like waiting it out. This is really even. I would say Ooh. this is almost in Red Team's favor just because of uh, how um, fragile Falco can be. Yeah. But Sun 2's playing really well. What? He oversteps. Oh my god, this is scary. Ooh. Oh, nice. Ooh. No jump? Oh, he has it. That was really close. Oh, right, Fox in the corner. That's where Falco wants Fox. Nice needle. I, right. I actually think that was somewhat of a save and somewhat a mess up. That roll okay. in was really bad, but he lives. Wow, Sheik. No, that's a dead Falco. Kind of fatty. There's no way. Oh, living, living, living. Oh, wow. <gasps> oh, my wow. gosh. That, that's a swing that's kind right of, there. That's like, kind of like the one the one time mix-up like that you never see really yeah. coming. Like, he just... No one does that scrubby dare. But, like, sometimes... It, it worked. Sometimes it works. Okay, this is... I kind of want to say that, like, each has the advantage here. No, I think Falco will... Can like, land a more solid hit easier. He doesn't think... die here to almost anything. Yeah, but... Yeah, but whatever he does get hit by, it's it puts him in a position where he's even easier to hit. This should be death, I think. Grab ledge. Oh, he's a little impatient. There oh, it is, nice. though. See, that's really hard to beat. The, it, it, um, auto cancel back. The shuffle, the shuffle bear into immediate bear. Yeah. Like, you when you're in much, the corner, Peach has to like roll in there. Yeah, and if you roll, then like you get hit with like the soft hit. Yeah, and, and then, then you just get knocked off again. Yeah. Rinse and repeat. So it kills. But for who was an advantage there? I'm only. I would safely say it's probably Falco because I feel like he gets the hit easier, but he, he doesn't get the kill easier. So. He doesn't get the kill there's easier. Like a Peach trade, needed Peach one hit. Yeah, she needed one hit. Falco, Falco needed just a needed like one. Yeah, and then like once she's off stage, it turns into a really easy. Hit. Yeah, for sure. So I think in terms of like who would win the neutral there, I think I would give it to Falco every time. Yeah, I'd kind of like I'd like Stadium here if I was if I was the Fox Peach, but. They go back to Dreamland. Yeah, oh, I feel like, I feel like Sun really has been really utilizing the top platform really well. Oh, nice. <laughs> now Weedle utilizing it. See, that's the thing, smashing. though. Like, when you're playing against a Falco, like, you have to realize that stage positioning is a lot. Like, you need to hold center and also control the top platform. Because Falco, get, he, he pretty much, like, is on a plane that no one else can really challenge because he can get to the top platform so fast. Yeah. And he can also fall down fast. Ooh, nice lasers here. Those were amazing lasers. Sun to uh, Johnny Snacks. I'm scrambling for a name here. <laughs> yeah. Corn's going to go down. Um, Sun Tzu has a chance to recover. Oh, nice amazing needle, needles. But but... A great reaction by Snacks. Oh, a nice great save, save by Corn. <laughs> Yo, how is Sun Tzu still alive? Like, that is the question. Still um, living. Is he going to go high here? Yeah. I would have went straight. I think straight was kind of like, it was kind of a 50-50 there, because I honestly thought that he would probably, ooh, ooh. nice, good coverage, good coverage. Back here? Oh, no, he should immediately just done it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, ledge hop bear. Yeah. Kind of hesitated. Uh, that's that's different there. So you remember when we saw the scenario where um, Sun Tzu was covering the ground and Korn was covered platform? They both tried to cover platform when Korn was in the more um, superior position to do so. Yeah. Ooh, nice back air there. Uh, I'm not liking how um, Snacks is kind of sitting back. He needs to he needs to abuse the low the low percent on the spacey to like get in there. He kind of just waited around and his teammate died in the process of it. I don't like that Peach is covering the platform. I feel like she she doesn't really get a lot of. Yeah, it. you know it's like I mean? you either get like the lucky down smash or you don't get anything pretty much. I think she does 
way way better at commanding the ground with down smash yeah. and dash attack. I think you have to let the fox like full hop back air there, and then just have the peach waiting in case there's a roll in or something. Ooh. Oh, we tried the side uh, wall jump side B. Nice shine. That was a really well timed shine. Dead Peach? Wow. Yeah, that's a dead Peach. Uh, he actually could have lived with better DI. He was at like a 90 before hit. And... This should be a dead fox. Yeah, that's it. This sh Ooh. Okay. This time... L down in the down smash, though. Down GG. smash? Good down throw. I like that down throw, because he didn't want to throw uh, the sheet towards his teammate yeah. for a potential save. He kind of wanted to keep a ledge positioning. But if you're going to go for that in that case, just do back throw. Just yeah. throw straight off stage. All right, now they're playing the neutral. I feel like you you often don't see like super resets and doubles. It's always kind of like mix ups on like who who's gonna retreat and who's gonna come in. But like that was a true reset. Both both uh, team teams were just like on the opposite side, uh, just recollecting themselves. Nice combo by Corn. I like Ooh. how Sun Tzu is keeping Weedle in the corner. Um, a lot of the time you'll see a scenario where like. You think, hey, maybe two teammates should be edge guarding, right? And especially if it's Fox, but you know, if Corn Corn had a really like dominant position there, if he just closed it out, then like there was Korn no. Corn has to hold ledge here, I yeah. think. But he lets go. He got a little scared there. Didn't want to get shined. This is still very even. I actually think this might benefit Blue Team if they were to get this kill. Oh, oh no! Never wow! Mind. Yeah, that's it. Bad jump there. A little panicky. You should have just went really low. You see, nice. this is actually still doable. Yeah, because if he gets this Fox stock, well, actually, I think he should I feel probably like he could just... kill the Peach first. I don't know about that. I feel like you want to take the Fox and no, then but the Peach like, is just if dead. No, but if you kill Fox now, then you have a low percent. Oh, yeah, now yeah. he has the 1v1. Yeah, if, you, to kill if him quick. you get the low percent Fox, it's harder to fight against. Fly right here. Uh, let's see. Nice. Oh, oh this is... really... Oh, no, that's, that's <laughs> it. <Yeah. laughs> no, he has Sakurai. a jump. He has a jump, but... It's gonna go for the ledge and it rolls. I don't agree with the down angle there, because you just have to hold the ledge there. The other person has the free on stage. Yeah, I would I would honestly just test the person who's supposed to pick me up. Just like keep going up. See if I can drift out of the way. Yeah. Um This is two one now, I believe. Yeah, yeah. two one. Sun Tzu corn favor and their counter pick favor. It is PCNJ Melee. PCNJ Melee. <laughs> Alright, so Stadium. This stage mm. is kind of like neutral, I think. Korn really was scouting out for that like team team combo follow-up, but he did a really like wrong aerial. He needed to do like an up air or, or a fair there. Um Gorn was kind of going in there, but it's really hard to go in when you have, to, when you're attacking one person and not hitting the, the other person at the same time. Yeah. Oh. I would almost suggest that like if you're if you have to two v one v two, you should almost always try to attempt to hit both of them at the same time. Interesting. That won't kill, but it puts Weedle in a really <laughs> bad position. Edge cancel. That was really smart by Snacks. Yeah, he, he like, got to the other side of the he stage. He regrouped really fast because. If he didn't, Weedle was pretty much like a sitting duck to just get hit with any strong kill move. I don't know how Sun Tzu died really fast, those two stocks, but he needs to not die yeah. like early again I mean, here. like, he's already like racking up damage. Oh, oh wow, that was... That's uh, a dead Sheik, yeah. Yeah, that was... Honestly, I think like you can't really go for risk at this stage. You need to like get your... Get yourself like background it. You can't really go for any crazy stuff like that. Not yeah. right now. It needs you need time to recruit recuperate. I don't know what I think about this stage. I actually think like Peach not having a top platform and having two characters that can't kill her off the top early kinda benefits the Fox Peach team. Yeah, I mean totally. Fox This is probably one this of This is Fo Fox's best stage. Um I think in terms of doubles, maybe maybe this team I would say is it's Fox's best stage for this team. I think like Fox's best stage overall in doubles is probably FD. Just in yeah. terms of like the blast zones are really good for him. Um, he has His good, full hop is amazing there. Yeah, he has a good wall to ride. Yeah. And team combos are really easy on that stage. I can agree with that. This is going Domination. really bad yeah. right now. Yeah. I think honestly, it's just. This stage and 
The fact that Sun Tzu died really early in yeah. the first two stocks. Weedle, is, Weedle and uh, Snacks are playing this really well, though. They're not, like... Oh, wow. That, that was that was quick. They're just... Oh, my God. Yeah, Snacks, nice shield Snacks there. is moving now. Yeah, he's feeling himself. That perfect that shine, shine out of shield. shield. I think that might have been a shield drop shine, actually. I it actually... I do that I do that with Fal uh, with Fox. I don't... I, no, with Falco. I, I can't do it with Fox. It's, yeah. like, so hard. It's actually the fastest out of shield option in the game. Yeah, shield drop shine. <laughs> Literally frame like what two? It probably comes yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, probably frame two if you do it frame perfect. Yeah. And this is where it's really hard. Like Falco's at the percentage where he'll get knocked down by a lot of aerials, and Sheik is gonna fly away to anything. Yeah, this is as good as done. He can take like another one or two stocks, but it's pretty much over. Fresh stocks against Unless these two characters. Unless he can characters. somehow gimp. Either one of these players twice. Yeah. There's actually this actually reminds me of something a long time ago at a Westchester local in Philly, a really old local like two three years ago. Um, Sun Tzu was actually playing doubles. I don't know what against what team, but this exact scenario. I don't think it was these characters where it was like this transformation, uh, four stocks to one, and he almost made the comeback. He ended up taking the, right, the shine the Falco. off the top is on the table. Oh, oh, never mind. If he could have got like a shine off the top on the peach and just like cheese the fox. Yeah, right. That'd have been that'd so have been crazy. So he um, it was it was the one v one with the Falco, and he ended up breaking the Falco shield. Yeah. <laughs> it was oh, the so last he, person. So he just started comboing the other person. No, no, no. So he he killed the other person, oh, and okay. it was a Falco he was playing against. He, he broke, broke the Falco shield? shield, and he didn't win the match. What? <laughs> well, what did he do? Like, I think did he, he just, him? I think he just like barely lost. It was like he barely got etched out. <laughs> That's funny. Do you remember dude. that? Yeah, you broke Bones' shield. <laughs> 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 who who was the other person that he was teaming with? Weedle, right? It was Weedle. It was Bones and Weedle, right? It was like a four to one stock like lead, and he, he killed Weedle, broke Bones' shield, but still lost the match. <laughs> Damn. So where do you think they'll? They're definitely not going back to stadium. No way. Yeah, absolutely no way. They I won mean, on battlefield and Yoshi's. FD. I think is not a bad pick. It gives you actual viability of killing Peach off the top, and also Falco kills uh, Fox way earlier off the sides than vice versa. Yeah. Um, I think Sheik playing aggro Sheik on this stage is actually pretty good, and this Yoshi's. is where they're going to go to. So I think they had Battlefield. I might have preferred that. This is this is a no, stage where no, they won where, game one on Battlefield. This is a stage where Peach uh, strives, I think. And yeah, doubles. but I also think the strengths that these two characters have on this stage. Like, look at this. Like, Peach is at kill percentage right now. Yeah. Up air. Oh. Oh, oh actually, I thought he could have maybe shined. Shine off of that, uh... I don't even remember the situation. He was at, like, 85, and he, like, got a shine from the ground. I think his snacks is at very low percent. And he, he can die here, too. Like, if bad DI, like, F smash. Yeah, yeah good down, down smash. smash. Nice needles there. Down smash? No, I should just it. grab the ledge and maybe look for Sun Tzu to pick up. <laughs> Dare from ledge. Corrin definitely does not know how to play Sheik. <laughs> 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 he, like, approached with Dare from ledge. All right, that should be Dead Fox. Good crouch cancel by Weedle. Oh, he lived that. Yeah, I mean, Down Smash doesn't kill that early. It's not that strong of a move if yeah. you DI it, like, somewhere. If you DI it correctly, it's actually not too strong. It just does a lot of damage. Yeah, if you hold down. And also puts you in a really bad spot. But, like, you won't outright die to Down Smash a lot of the time. Good, good uh, shield drop wave land. A lot of people would just try to attack there, but Horn realized that he wasn't in position to do any kind of like offensive or defensive attack, so he just completely removed himself from that scenario. I actually don't agree with that. I wanted him to hold ledge. I don't really care that Weedle was there. Oh, yeah. that will kill. Grab ledge. He just oh needs no. One hit. Oh no. Okay. Oh okay. I think Snacks had time to like not panic there with the recovery. Yeah, he was kind of just like, I need to, I need to do something now. Yeah, but he did. He definitely had like a. Oh, this, oh. this will be a stock if he go down there. Grab it, hold it. That's roll. it. Yeah, that's it. Dead. Wow, wow that's a thirty. See, that's what I'm stock. talking about. Like Fox, he's good on oh. this stage in terms of kill power, but he can. These just, two characters can kill him very easily. Yeah, you on get him stage. off stage at such low percent, you can just like cheese him, you know. And with that young edge guard. Really good pl platform play by Sun Tzu. Like, really solid. Right, Weedle covering the roll out. Up smash? This is important right here. Whatever happens here. 
They're still getting pressure, but now it's kind of over. Yeah. Oh, now Sun too. Like yeah, he just pressure. that was like a big reversal. Like they they were both like put ushering him in the corner. Oh, oh my God! Does he go, go in down again? there? Go Does down go in, there. Yeah, right? do it. Like you have stocks to do. Oh, but he got this. He just he just took it anyway. It's. I was just I would have just like I would just downer. consider this over at this <laughs> point. Like it's so hard to make this comeback. Yeah. S Snacks Even if pretty Sun much he, dies. He, he, Snacks can't get hit once essentially. Like He's any, dead. Any hit, yeah, it's like over. That's like a free kill. You see, yeah, and now Peach is as good as dead too. Yeah. I, I would have up aired if I was a uh, corn there. Maybe Sun Tzu got the shine. <laughs> the UGS, but like reversed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that uh -oh. was cool, really. <laughs> he's trying to be cool, but he's just not <laughs> cool. Dude. Like, dude, he doesn't know how to main Sheik. Yeah. He doesn't mean Sheik. He did ledge hop <laughs> there. <laughs> ledge hop dare, dude. Who does that? All right, we're up next. All right, good luck, dude.